So when I first talked to you, we were standing on top of a building in China, and you just joined the Warriors. Here we are now. You've got an NBA championship. You got a shirt on, which we didn't right. expect, because we saw you in the parade. You were running around without a shirt. But what, what made you dress up today? You know, I had to come a little more formal as I can, you know, but I still got the chest out a little bit. Yeah. But I'm not a suit guy. You know, I couldn't do a suit after I won a champion, so um, I just tried to come as as professional as Swaggy P could come, you know, to a black tie event. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, and then this is what you came up with. Right. This looks like sweatpants. Yeah, yeah, sweatpants. It's like magnetic with the zippers. But I still wore dress shoes, so I just, you know. Right. You got it. It's, uh, it's a look. It's, it's a look. Right. It's an interesting look. Uh, describe your season with the Warriors. There were some ups and downs. Yeah. But, you know, as I think back, I was thinking about this last night. I said, you know what? I would not have expected him to be d up James Harden and locking him down in, in the Western Conference Finals. That's part of your legacy with yeah, the Warriors. For sure. And, um, that was just a big moment for me, just the whole playoffs and stepping up to the plate when we, you know, didn't have an Eagle Dollar playing in the uh, Western Conference Finals and me getting switched up on James and Chris Paul sometimes. Uh, I knew I, I didn't want to look bad. I had to uh, play my hardest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What is in your immediate future? I know it's not going to be with the Dubs. Yeah. Uh, you were a Laker. Mm -hmm. The Lakers are are adding pieces, <laughs> uh, some big pieces. JaVale is with them. LeBron yeah. is with them. What's what's happening with you? Um, you know, just waiting out my options and um, seeing what's the best fit for me. You know, and, uh, let's see. It's the waiting game right now. Let's see what happens. Well, now you're a defensive stopper. I mean, <laughs> you got to tell all the GMs that, right? I lock right? people up. <laughs> yeah, you know, hopefully they've seen that, but. Uh, you know, I, I know they've seen it. It was the biggest stage in, uh, yeah. uh, in the NBA right there. So Let's talk about the ESPYs a little bit, because as an L.A. guy, you've been here before. Yeah. But what do you like about the night? Um, just a chance to see all these great athletes and everybody in one, you know, building and celebrating just sports period from all from all sports and just enjoying the moment. Yeah. yeah. You know, uh, female empowerment is a big issue this year. Yeah. Uh, on, a, on a more serious note, your thoughts on that and, and all the women that are going to be up there tonight in connection with uh, Michigan State? Um, I think that's big. I think um, it's very important. I think it's, it's a great stage to, to notice and um, to, to give thanks to everything they've been doing. So, yeah. Yeah. Appreciate your time. It's good to see you. Dressed up. Take care, man. <laughs> Appreciate it. All right.